May 2010, M1, question 8. Part 1, we have to draw a force diagram. First force I'm going to add is the tension in the string. At both Q and at P, there's going to be a reaction force. I'm going to call the reaction force at Q, Q, and the reaction force at P, P. The weight of each mass is going to be acting down, so we have 3G and 5G. And finally, we have to add friction. We're told in the question that's going to move down towards the heavier mass. So if the 5 block is moving down the slope, then the friction, which on this side I'm going to call F, is going to oppose the motion. On the other side, in the P, if it is moving up the slope, friction again must oppose motion, so it will be moving down the slope. And in this case, I'm going to label it R. We're going to consider particle P first. I've redrawn the force diagram for P and resolved the weight into its components. First thing I can write down is that P must equal 3G cos 40. And that friction, my friction is R, is mu P. So that's 0 0.3 times 3G cos 40, which equals 6.7565. If we look along the slope, resultant force in the direction of motion has to equal mass times acceleration. I'm not going to substitute in my value for R. So I have T minus 25.6544 equal 3A. Whole way through this question, I'm being careful to work to more than 3SF so I don't lose any marks for accuracy. I'm going to repeat this now for particle Q. So the first thing I can write down is Q equals 5G cos 60. So that is 24 and a half. Friction equals mu Q. Mu is 0 0.1, so that's 0 0.1 times 24.5, 2.45. If I then look parallel to the plane, the resultant force in the direction of motion has to equal mass times acceleration. 39.9852 minus T has to equal 5A. If I now combine my equations for P and Q, and I add them together, the t's are going to be eliminated. I'm left with 14.3308 has to equal 8a, so the acceleration will be 14.3308 divided by 8, which is 1.791, 1.79 meters per second squared. Substituting into the equation for p, t minus 25. 0.6544 goes 3 times 1.79 gives a tension of 31.0 newtons to 3SF.